of Sex Battles. Welcome, I'm your host, Jacob, a.k.a. Gator. Y'all know me for the page. Sex Battles page. Much love to everybody, first of all, for liking the page. Man, we well over 200 likes right now. So shout out to everybody that likes the page. Thanks to y'all. We are still number one. That's right. We still number one. We doing it like that. We doing it big. Uh, tonight's conversation. Let me jump into this because yeah, it's gonna be a good one. Tonight's conversation. We talking about um, basically. I call it the unclaimed <laughs> ticket. Basically, I call it that because there are a lot of people running around saying all kind of stuff like we're together, you belong to me, they're tagging you on Facebook, they're hitting you up on Twitter, they're telling everybody you're in a relationship, and um, it's not true. <laughs> Say what? Come on. I know y'all heard about this now. There are people running around all over the place saying that they're in a relationship with a certain person, and, um, <clears throat> yeah, that person knows nothing about this relationship. I mean, I- I'll tell you all about my situation later. But, yeah, this is unclaimed tickets. Like, you got to claim your ticket when you go get your baggage and luggage from the airport. These are unclaimed tickets that are just left. <laughs> we gonna talk about this tonight, Joe. Who else we got in here? Man, what's up? Uh, check what's it out. Up? We got the lovely Monique up in here. Hello, Monique. Welcome, what's going Monique. On? Mm-hmm. Monique. Mm-hmm. Monique is a regular. I know Monique knows about mm-hmm. Monique. Mm-hmm. Stop moaning. Has somebody has somebody ever claimed you? And you know nothing about it. <laughs> no, that's called a fatal attraction. <laughs> hey, that ain't called. That ain't called no unclaimed. That ain't called claim. That's called fatal attraction. That's what that's called. That's the type wow. of person that will you will come home and you will find a pot on your stove with a boiled bunny up in it. It's not. You know that that right there. Is the type where you walk in your house and a person sitting there cooking you dinner, and you like, how the hell you get in here? Which way are you trying to figure out? Like, <laughs> it's no way around it. I mean, I, I I can't say I've never been claimed like that, but th- that's something wrong with that picture. <laughs> 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 you being claimed, and you go out and, you know, it's like, hey, boo, what, what hey, boo, who the hell? What, where, where do you, where, where so, you come from? So what you telling me, Monique? Ain't nobody ever walk up to you and say, hey, Monique, how you doing? Hey, girl, congratulations. I heard about you and your new boo. And you was no, like, who? Who? Um, Tony. You know you and Tony together. I heard you and Tony mm-hmm. together. You know, how long y'all been talking? Mm-hmm. Cause, cause if you're going to claim me, I need to know about it because there ain't no way I'm going to wake up in the morning and you going to be next to me or somebody going to say, hey, Monique, what's up with you and so-and-so? Who? who? No, we're going to fight about that. Hey, ain't, no, ain't, no, ain't no, What do I always say? Do not pass go and do not collect $200. That, that ain't going to work. Oh, wow. What you talking about? What you talking about? What you talking about? What you talking about? I kind of want to say, does that person live in their own little world that it's like you would it turns into a federal attraction? Because there is no way you ain't, you ain't going to know who claimed you. That's what I'm saying. It's Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. I don't care where you're at. If you're with somebody, that person is going to know regardless. If you have a crush, that's a difference. 
but just mm-hmm. to ha- make up a Facebook page and it's you and that person and it's all lovey-dovey, yeah, you, you need to be in a straight <laughs> white jacket in a room with nothing but pillows because you are crazy. Ooh. You, I'm, I'm just saying, there is there is no way that. because I, I'm not going to claim nobody. That's just saying I'm not going to be with somebody who don't love me. You're, you can't force somebody to love you. That is forcing somebody to love you. And to actually, that's going to push the person away even further. Because so, they're going to think exactly what you just said. They're crazy. They're crazy. So my thing is, I'm not going to have, I'm going to get a restraining order or something against you if you're trying to claim me. I ain't no baggage. I'm sorry. I ain't, I ain't no from Southwest, Alaska, Delta, United, whatever you want to say. I ain't, I am no Wow. Oh, man. Here we go. Here we go. Are you guys ready for this? Are you guys ready? Here we go. Uh-oh. Ladies and gentlemen, she is the new queen of extreme on WCC Broad. Give it up for Kara. Yeah, did you get mad? Great music. I felt so honored. Oh. <laughs> anyway. Oh, that was. Oh, um, so that was. That was Mo in the background. Like, why she getting, she getting music? <laughs> um, you gonna get some theme music? Oh. I don't want no damn theme music. Not now. Oh, Hi, everybody. Hello, Kira. Welcome to the show. We talking about people claiming people. Cause. You ever had been in that situation, you didn't claim, and you didn't know it? Well, I can say this, like, I've been claimed a couple different ways. Like, who I'm with now, my fiancé, like, it was kind of like one of those things, like, she thought we were dating before I even realized mm-hmm. it. And then we're like, oh. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, and Joe. Yes, she said her fiance. She thought, yes, that's what she said, Joe. Oh my! To clarify things, this was go ahead. Clarify. Go ahead. This is like this was like at the beginning of our relationship, and I wasn't the only one. Like I thought we were dating, and she thought we were dating. It just wasn't official, so technically we claimed each other. So. I mean, it was an okay situation for that. So, but so I've been in other right. situations like I woke up one morning, got on Facebook to find out some dude that I didn't even fucking know claimed to be like a boyfriend or something. And oh, someone wow. has to be like, hey, Kara, I heard you're dating this person. Who is he? I'm like, who the fuck is he? I don't <laughs> fucking know. <laughs> <laughs> Dueling, you need to stop doing that shit. Dueling, stop it. <laughs> <laughs> like, seriously, I, I responded to this person like, hey, if you know this person, that's all right, but I have no idea who this fucking person is. Person wow. Is. <laughs> and, Damn. like, when I found out what the person, who the person was, I was like, dude, shut the fuck up and quit claiming me, or I will freaking kick your ass. I don't care where you live. Yeah, I didn't. I mean, like, I heard of people I, claiming I, I, people I that they happy. know. <laughs> Not somebody you don't know. Damn. Oh, you get arrested for that. It's called restraining order. It's called stalking. That's called you need to run. I know. I later found out that it was some guy from Indonesia. I'm like, who the fuck is he? I can't even. Wow. Wow. That was an arranged relationship. <laughs> Maybe my mother set me up on accident. I'm so, I'm so mad at Monique. <laughs> but, Damn, bro, like, like the fuck? Yo, who so, else we got in here? <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, he is the WCC Brawl Mayhem Champion, one co-founder of the WCC Brawl. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Thursday Night himself, Big Red. I'm okay, I'm going to need y'all ladies to calm down. That is Red's theme music for his show. 
Calm down, We ain't on his show. We ain't on his show. Do you know who I am? What's up, Red? You know my meditation. What the hell you are? Hey, Red. What's good? We talking about people claiming each other. We know for a fact you've been claimed a couple of times. Yeah. In that situation. (laughs) Oh, sorry. What? What, was, what did you do when you found out somebody was claiming you read? Say, I, I turned, I turned, and, and, and went left field. <laughs> that means he's still Wait. being claimed. That's what that means. <laughs> I'm so gonna say, what does that mean? <laughs> as as a, I, I don't like nobody claiming me. Like, yo. You, I, I'm, I'm wild and free right now. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you and, did call yourself a wild and beast. Go ahead. Oh. <laughs> is, is that, yeah, is that like I'm a wildebeest right now. Like, I can't be tamed at the moment. No, a wild and beast. That. A wild and beast. You said you wild. The reason you can't change is because you haven't found anyone to change for. Mm. Well, then. And you're not willing to change for. That's the key. Exactly. I mean, I mean, I ain't gonna lie. There, there's one person in my life that I would, but it gets to that point, then yeah, it, it, it it's gonna be that right now. At that point. Oh. But what if you found out right now she's yeah. claiming you? Like she's going around right now saying, "Hey, you know me." And right now she's my double person. I wouldn't mind claiming me. Don't don't even talk to him because that's my man. Oh, she already got the wedding invitation. <laughs> <laughs> really got quiet. <laughs> okay, but no, for real. Though. <laughs> <laughs> no, <I'm not> <laughs> but no, for real. Though, like, he took like, the phone from his ear, like what? <laughs> but no, for real. Though, like, you know, the way I feel about her, I, I, she's probably one person that I wouldn't mind claiming me without, you know, actually being official. So who is this like? Oh, I'm sorry, Red. Um, Joe, who I mean, else is in here? I mean, <laughs> I mean, I mean yeah. hey, there's no secret who she is. I mean, y'all see me in pictures with her on my Facebook, so you know what I'm saying. I, I, I still don't know her. Wait, 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 but are you claiming her? That's why you got the Facebook pictures up? Hmm? Hmm? Are you secretly mm. claiming her? No, I'm not claiming her. Oh, I mean, we, we took the pictures. Fuck. We took the pictures <laughs> together. I mean, she, she, she's on my Facebook, so she can see the pictures that I post up. Ooh. Ooh, so, so there's something. Mystery that woman. To it. Mystery woman, you heard him. I know you listen to the show. Don't take pictures. No. <laughs> Just uh, who else are you? Uh, 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 to reply to that, it was her idea to take pictures in the first place. Wow. Yeah, for the wedding invitation. Who who else in here? Man. (laughs) Man, let's take this ship back to the... Let's take this ship back to the Midwest. Ladies and gentlemen, put your panties back up, ladies. It's Roosevelt. Oh, bro. (laughs) (laughs) I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I was was getting my little... I was sorry, I was getting my little genuine dance song while he did oh, that. Oh, God, music. here you uh, go. That was pretty, uh, that was pretty dope. Okay, bro. Well, yeah. Unlike Red, we know you on the other side of the fence. Who are you claiming? Ooh. Oh, I mean, um. <laughs> what are you attraction to? What do you mean? What, what, uh, what side of the fence is he on? What team he playing for? <laughs> oh. Bro, right now I'm playing the, um, the engagement. Bro, um, bro we're not that. Well, we ain't talking about the video game, bro. No. Come, come away from the video game. <laughs> hey, bro, in a situation where somebody is claiming you, like, let's just say you go on Facebook one day, you punch in your password, you get online, and you got, like, 12 messages in your inbox from people saying, wow, I didn't know you and such and such was together. Another female hit you up like, dang, you could have told me. Uh, another person hit you up like, oh, congratulations. 
That's what's up. Bro. Mm hmm. What do you do if you don't know what the hell they talking about? <laughs> First of all, I'll try to run like Martin off a of thin love between love and hate. <laughs> oh, See, but you'll have a cake with a knife at your doorstep. <laughs> I ain't sending that damn cake. That motherfucker is damn garbage. Have you been in this situation before? Nope. Thank God I have oh, to. Liar. I don't know how to react. Ooh. Huh? Ooh. Did somebody just say liar? Somebody just don't believe you. Uh-oh. Ooh. Somebody no, said your pants are on fire. See, me, I'm not a player, and I don't play games with females. I let them know right off back what it is. Like, if I'm in a relationship, I'm in a relationship. If I'm single, I'm like, at that point, I ain't trying to deal with nobody. You know, yeah, I got female friends. But, but you I'm, still have those people out there that you will tell you're in a relationship and next thing you know, pictures on your Facebook and stuff will still pop up. Like, that doesn't – nowadays you can tell a person, but that still doesn't mean anything. People are starting to believe Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter over anybody's word now. Thank you, Ro. Ro, what she's saying is there's a lot of women that don't care if you're in a relationship or not. <laughs> <laughs> you got men? Wait, wait, you got men out there too, though. That's what I see. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. And they worse than women. They worse than women. Oh, hell no. Yeah. That, they are actually, worse than women. Wow. You know I'm going to agree with Monique on this. Man, because you know me, I, I bat for the women's side, you know, give it from the male perspective and the woman, you know, view us. Men are worse than women. Because the men can see it on Facebook like, oh, he's in, he in a relationship with such and such. But still, an inbox are like, hey, baby, ooh, you know, you look beautiful today and stuff right. like that, blah, blah, blah. Then, you know, like, well, she'd be like, she'd be like, I got you. <laughs> okay, that's it. So, okay, your, your, your man card has been revoked. No, your man card has not been revoked. Get out. Well, you know what? I give it back to you. Your man card has not been revoked. No, 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 no. no. I'm, just, I'm just keeping it real, though, honestly. Men are worse than women when it comes to that. Cause Dude. They, even on the street, they're still, they're still female. I'm, I'm, with a I'm, man. I'm sorry, if but yeah, away, I, I've seen worse women than like, men. I'm if sorry. If you step away for like two minutes, that dude gonna kind of holler like, "Hey, baby, what's up?" You know, I got a man right, but yeah, but he ain't doing it like I could. He ain't doing it like right. I could do it. Bam. Right. Right. I think we had this I'm not. I'm not gonna deny that. You no, know, men are not thirsty like that. But hey. Women can be just as thirsty as men can. But you know what? But women, but are sneaky, wait, women are sneaky. Women are sneaky or in in a, in a different way than men are. Men will publicly put it out there, like you said. They will. They will. You, if you in the at a restaurant and your man go to the bathroom, that man go sneaky. Hey, you know what? Give me five minutes of your time. I can change your mind real quick. Yeah. Women yeah. gonna come. A woman's gonna come a, a different avenue at you if she know you with mm. another woman. It's going to be mm. totally different the way like, she's What the women do is the women still smile. She's trying to smile mm -hmm. and giggles in a way to show that her attraction is to you without right. putting it out there, without you even knowing in front of your girlfriend because the girlfriend won't know, but the men. Your girlfriend could be next to you, and that woman who still like you can, can change your mind real quick. And we'll do it in front of your woman. We'll do it. Mm. In, men will wait till the other wow. man go to the bathroom, but a woman will will do it right in front of another another woman, just to see what her and, reaction is. Is that why well, women? Well, I find well, really well, sad well, just thinking about it. And um, you know, I'm not generally saying that one size works than the other, because sometimes in some form or way, women can be just as bad as guys can too. Because everyone has their approach depending on the person. There are some people that, that won't go public about it. And then, you know, especially, like, if you have a woman that's a completely in love with you and they know that you have a girlfriend, they are willing to make that other girlfriend jealous, which, quite frankly, if I was that girlfriend, I'd be pissed off because, like, women, I think, sometimes have more sway over men. And just like sometimes men can have, you know, the, the same effect on the other women, but, I mean, just regardless, people can really be really bad about it no matter what your gender is. 
Right. It's a but, it's, you know, but you know what it is? It's what you exactly. It's it's Thank you. Challenge. What people don't understand is called a challenge, and people like challenges, and that's the thing. The key to it is at the end of the day to get that other person. Yeah, but men are women. But who they can't have. That's just like when you become official with someone, that's when all of the ex-girlfriends or people who liked you in the past will come. Thank you. But when you by yourself, you nobody will approach <laughs> you from 10 no, miles she's away. Right. She's right because I had that happen. Like when I was single, nobody wanted to talk to me. But now I'm in a relationship, oh, hey. How you and your girlfriend doing? Blah blah blah. I'm like, you see, I'm in a relationship, but yeah. And, and you know what? And that's how you know when somebody was jealous. And people right. are hungry for something. When someone is single, there's there's not as much desire. And people go on people that are in relationships because, like Winnie said, it's a challenge. People love a challenge. So if someone's taken and they really want that person, you better bet that they're going to give their all to do that kind of thing. And what people don't understand, right there, it, it was said, if you, you can really tell if somebody's claiming you or if somebody wants you just by the first words they say, by the first sentence, how's you and your significant other? Hmm. That's how, if you get that and that's in the first sentence after, hi, how you doing? That's what you already know. They're, in their mind, their challenge is, hey, all right, how you and your girlfriend doing or how you and your boyfriend we so so or we okay. All right, then I know what what avenue I'm gonna take to get into your heart. Right. Hmm. Mm-hmm. That's wow. why people don't understand. You have to if you give a person two minutes of your time and they ask you and you never think of, oh my God, they're just asking me how me and my girlfriend or boyfriend is doing, and they're just asking out of kindness. Hell, freaking no, they're not asking out of kindness. They're not. They're and sometimes they can what? be often confused too, because. I don't think a lot of people take that kind of statement seriously at what it is. It's mm. like, okay, maybe someone's just trying to make nice chit-chat. Mm. And then it sinks in eventually, I'm like, oh, fuck. Mm. That's when you got to put on your thinking cap and detect the yep. bullshit that's coming out of their mouth. Right. You know what? So, so what y'all I, saying I, is, oh, go ahead, Red. I was just going to say, I'm a different breed because I've asked people that before, and I ain't trying to get to nobody. I would just make conversation. <laughs> You got to understand your pit bull, your pit bull and rock mix no, together. No, 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 no. See, the thing is, I don't fuck with married women like that. That's a no-no. I ain't got well, no, ain't nobody got no time for that shit. Ain't nobody got no time for that shit. But my thing is, no matter, if you ask her how she's doing, she gonna, it could be the other person can interpret that different, too. It don't have to. You could be making conversation. That's what you don't get. You could be making conversation. Red, but that hmm. other person's going to think something. It, 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 that's just how the, – it's not back in the day when relationship – you got Facebook and everything. In the 50s and the 60s and the 70s, you, just, you had this, but it was not as worse as it is today. It's like hmm. you was in, when you was in elementary school and you liked somebody, you wrote them a note. You didn't send them a text. You wrote them out. Do you like me? Check yes or no or maybe. Thank you. It's not – let me – let me tw- let me Twitter you, or let me Facebook you, or let me claim you, and not even know about it. Because you got your rejection in that note. If you didn't get the note back, you knew that person didn't like you. You just knew, or if they checked, no. But nowadays, it's this computer and electronic generation. Love is through the Internet. Love is through the cell phone. Love is through Twitter. Love is through Instagram. Like I said, people will look at your pictures on Facebook and go, oh, Seven different ways where it only means one thing. Joe, who else we got up in here? Hold um, on, we got we got more people to get in here. Wait till we get everybody in here. We should have. I know y'all ready. <laughs> <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, here, ladies and gentlemen, uh-huh. it is my honor, my duty, my pleasure to bring Why is he my best friend. Why are you yelling? Why are you yelling? Your best friend. My Uh-oh. best friend is here. Ladies Uh-oh. and gentlemen, please welcome. The biggest pervert that I know. He needs one freak. <laughs> oh, he Lord. needs two freaks. He needs three freaks. I know he's talking he needs about. four freaks. He needs five. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> you gotta say his name. What's up, Palmer? Hello, mister. 
Hello, Mr. Martin. How are hey, you I first? feel so loved right now. <laughs> and it's like I'm happy the ladies don't complain that they're giving the guy the interception. So hold on. Yeah. Wait, hold on. Mommy, stop rolling your eyes. Paul, oh, how you doing tonight? <laughs> I'm know, doing good well, tonight. I will say this. I've never been claimed by any woman because, hey, uh, I want to be paying Sunday, but not right now because, hey, I'm fine. Hey, I am fine just the way I am right now, even though it kind of gets a little lonely and stuff. And stuff, but it's uh-huh. like I never be claimed before. Some women don't care if you want to be single. Ooh. They still don't claim you. That's okay, uh, okay, uh, okay, let's see. In high school, I was dating this chick, and then it's like, uh, and then it's like another girl was trying to sweet talk me, and I'm like, I already knew that, you know, she was trying to, like, uh, get me to break up with her, to go with her, and I'm like, no way in hell. Wow. <laughs> see, that's a whole nother stuff. Yeah. We, mm. hold on, Paul. We don't get on that. Who else is, though? Let's get them all in. Wow, here we, oh, here, we, combo. here we go, here we go, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the lovely Miss Queen B. Uh-oh. Hi, BSF, I missed you. Hey, Ronnie. See, I'm hey. kind of feeling a certain way, too, Joe. Now, now my Queen backup's and, here, my backup's uh, here. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Queen, I know you ain't did it before, but have you ever been claimed without your knowledge? Ooh. Like... Oh, hey, yo, me and Queen together, dog. Don't even holler at her. All right, cool. Wow, man. I'm hey, Jacob, I told you not to tell nobody I told you that. Ooh. Oh, hell. Oh, hell no. I'm sorry. I, I didn't know that was a secret conversation. Wow. Um, mm, I don't even know where to go from here. Uh, that's a whole different Yeah, Queen, what you got to say about that? She don't roll like that. I said... I had a dude a little while ago on Facebook hit me up like, Uh-oh. yeah, um, I know you're a busy woman, but can I be your Facebook boyfriend? Wait, and what's his name, Big Red 79? Mm. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> hey, me. I, I wasn't born in 79, so that wasn't me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wow. So he just asked you to be a Facebook boyfriend? He, he well, you, y'all know my, my page is, is public. And, yeah, um, it's listed. Oh. And he was saying, he was like, yeah. He commented, he would comment on all my pictures. He would like all my pictures. And then all of a sudden, he was like, he hit me in the inbox. Yeah, could I be your Facebook boyfriend? And I'm like, Facebook boyfriend? And I didn't think nothing of it in a... A day will go past, and I get a message, oh, you ignore me, huh? And then I get another message. It's just crazy. Like, he literally he wanted me to change. Okay, wait, okay, I'm I'm flawed. So now we got oh, faith. Muted. Got a re- wait, no, first of all, hold on. Pump your brain. <laughs> 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 don't, don't, be, don't, don't, be, don't do my BFF like that. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, that's my ride and die chick. My ride and die chick got my back. My Ooh. thing is, so nowadays you can have a boyfriend or girlfriend outside, but then you can have a Facebook boyfriend or girlfriend. That's another this is show. Like, this, is what uh, the, this is what the kids, that's what they do. That's a totally different show because I, Wow. <laughs> Wow. You know, you know what, wow. Queen? I think there is a word for people like that who pretty much do all that on Facebook. That's called stalker. What is it? <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Yeah, it's not only, hey, it's not only on Facebook. And get, get to know where I'm going with this. They do that shit on IMVU, too. Ooh. See, I mean, so it's like this. I'm going to tell y'all my story. Hold on. Oh, let, me get, oh. let me get everybody in here. Who else is oh, here, Joe? Wow. You know what? I, I I always say this is Gator Show, but guess what? Guess Uh-oh. what? Uh oh. Here you go. Oh, Here hell we go. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, yes, yes, ladies and gentlemen, your boy NC Benetico will oh, be God. participating tonight on this one. Trust me, ladies. Uh-oh. You you don't want to one minute what I'm about to say, but go ahead. Uh oh. Oh, 
this is my situation. Okay, so yeah. I'm on Facebook. I'm on Twitter. I'm on IMVU. I'm on all these sites, right? Okay, so Damn. I get on Are Skype. Are you lonely? I'm oh, sorry. You know what? I am a DJ, <laughs> and I do this for life. <laughs> <laughs> hey, who we got in the doorbell? What the hell? Know. What the hell? What is that? I don't know. Open the door. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Why are your doors closed? Oh, you need to be oh, 40. I'm so mad at you, Monique. <laughs> 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 Who just came through my door? Who are you? Motherfucker, you already know where it is. Oh, hell no. Hell no. Oh, hell, 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 hell to the no. If you oh, don't know who this is, I'm going to tell you this like that. This is a rapper. Wow. <laughs> wow. 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 I already told you what's going on. Have you been claimed before? <laughs> Nigga, you already know. You remember Peaches? <laughs> 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 I came out there, damn. I knew that who was that <laughs> Man, Peaches ain't got the fuck out of me. I go up in the club, Peaches over there. She popping on the floor and shit, you know what I'm saying? Next thing I know here, she come, little bro, try to holler. And I'm over there politicking with her. She come, throw my drink out my fucking hand, getting a broad face talking about, uh-uh, you ain't fucking with him. That's my dick. And you ain't fucking with him. <laughs> <laughs> now, that's a but, G right there. Ooh. That's a G. Right? Okay, bro. Right. But we do. But we do. Hold up. There's more. Hold up. Hold up. I'm sitting up there. I'm like, wait, hold up. Hold up, little mama. Look here. You know what I'm saying? Number one, you know, me and you, what we do is what we do. However, we ain't got no label. You know what I'm saying? We ain't going to be no label because I know your track history. You know what I'm saying? Ain't going to be Damn. no label. Damn. Damn. <laughs> Shit. I mean, look, where, where I was at at the time, I ain't had no problem bringing Sand of the Beast because the Sand of the Beast was dirty. So, I mean, you know, that that why I was there, you know? <laughs> yeah, I I bought it, I bought her a bottle of blue bees and a blunt and she was straight. That's it. You know what I mean? <laughs> what? So, That's gangster. <laughs> so you know that was it. I'm like I call up. She be like, Hey, my honey. Be like, oh, yeah, I got that bees and I got that blunt. What's that? Honey? Oh, I'm a. <laughs> <honey."> <laughs> you know. I'm going to need you to stop giving women weed. Uh, hey, it is what it is. I mean, there's some women out there that just, yo, you got a blunt? Yeah, I got a blunt. I'm coming through. What is it? And that's what you want. Exactly. That ain't no woman that's a hoe. You can say what you want. I ain't going to find a blunt, but I'll tell you what. I ain't doing like Rick Ross popping Molly that they ain't even know it. Wow. <laughs> you know. Uh, <laughs> wow. I'm done with I'm, you, rapper. Wait, I'm just putting him on mute. I'm done with you. You just, yeah, I'm, hey, hey, hey. I'm speechless. For once in my life, I'm speechless. But, man. That's a first. <laughs> oh. I'm just saying. No. Uh, I mean, that's it. But, yeah, man, she used to always cuff me. And then this other little bro, man, oh, my God. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Back in the day, he used to call me cuffing. Man, oh, dude. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. It was a song made about it called No Cussing. <laughs> mm. That a little bro. I remember that song because I played it. <laughs> she, this bro used to get mad at me because I was happy. Because <laughs> I was happy. What the? F- oh God. Yeah, it's it's a woman that do it. Sounds familiar. She used yeah. to get mad because I was happy. I'm talking about you need to take things a little more seriously. I'm like, baby, you don't even know my struggle or my hustle. I'm gonna stay happy regardless. Well, maybe if you took me a little more scared. <laughs> oh, wait, oh, wait. Man, you don't know my struggle or my hustle. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
She was like, well, maybe if you, if you would have a serious conversation with me, maybe you could see what I'm about. I'm like, well, maybe if you ain't noticed, I ain't had a serious conversation with you yet other than talking about me hitting the skin, so I'm really not taking you seriously. So, you know, oh, so it's like that. Well, I mean, fuck, I'm being real with you. It is what I ain't it feeling is. It, I ain't feeling it. I mean, you knew what it was. Some people, some mean. women take that. It's like once you stick your meat in a taco, like you are officially layered. Hold on. Yeah. Wait, hold on. Did you just say meat in a taco? No, no, no. That's typically how some women can be. Because if you don't some, need if a woman about. wants someone that bad, it's like, you know what? I don't care if, if who they're with or whatever. I, I'm going to claim them as mine, and they're going to only be mine. Kind of thing. Well, I'm going to tell you all right now, Jacob, you you on the same team as me with dick. I don't want to like dick women. If you ain't wearing at least a size 10 or 12, I ain't fucking with you. So, it is this is a broad. That's what she said. I understand. To I understand. me, it doesn't <laughs> matter what size or what age are the woman oh, is, so. or whatever person, I'm not going to let that person claim me either way. I'm going to bitch them out like they're fucking nothing. Oh, wow. But, but you so, know, wait, so. wait. But my thing wait. is, but you're, you're feeding into them. That's why, like, you just Bro, have to leave them alone. Them. Because if you bitch them out, if you fight them and stuff like that, they want a reaction. Oh, That's what they're really trying to do. When somebody is trying to claim you, they want a reaction from you. Now, if you don't give them a reaction... That's where you're going to kill them. That's true. So let me let me tell you let me finish telling you y'all. I like to think like oh, silence no, no. is no. deadly. That is, that is not oh, God. necessarily no. true. No, I have to go now. Damn it! Hold on. Wait. Hold on. Let me open it though. Hello. Hello. Yeah. What's happening? What's happening? Who else had the door? What the who is that? Flash. <laughs> I, I would like to know what is the, what is tonight's topic of conversation. You know what, Fresh? When you come to the door and you ain't got nothing in your hand. <laughs> <laughs> this is I, just, I, 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 I drove by the house and I saw everybody parked outside, so I figured I'd <laughs> <laughs> Just like black folk. My people, man, I swear. <laughs> Tonight, first, we talking about unclaimed tickets. We talking about people that that claim you without your knowledge. Like, have you ever been claimed and you didn't know it until somebody walked up to you and was like, "Hey, fresh, congratulations on your new girlfriend." What? <laughs> oh, you, you talking about the people who date people that don't don't really be dating you? They be dating you in your mind. No, these are the, we talking about these people that are claiming you that without your them. knowledge. Like, you don't even know they're claiming you until somebody says something. Right, mm-hmm. that's, that's, that's the people that they be in a relationship, but you don't be in one. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. <laughs> okay, now that you put it that way, yeah. Them people, right. right. <laughs> you her boyfriend, but you don't even know what she be talking about. <laughs> you don't even know her name. <laughs> what you do in that situation, dog? I thought that kind of stuff only happened to celebrities. Oh, wow. Call, call, the, call the fucking I mean, police I, and grab I don't, a blanket. I don't know. Like, if, if somebody is claiming you and you are unaware that they're claiming you, I mean, depending on her psychological mind state, I would say go talk to her. But if they're claiming you without your knowledge, you might want to stay away from them because they're already nothing. <laughs> Anybody that put their stamp on you, fam, and you have no idea that they did this, you should just avoid them at all costs because they might hurt you and the motherfucker you with if they spot you. Wow. That's a fatal yeah. attack, no, that's not true. Roll up. Correct me if I'm wrong, but part of crazy and kind of like slow people is part of the reason why you keep fucking with them because we all know that people with developmental disabilities have no concept of pain or when to start or stop. <laughs> that is part of the reason why we keep fucking with them. 
Oh, hey, man, guys, I, I have to go. But before I want to go, I want to say, you know what? Fuck the claimers. Oh, wow. Thank you, man. <laughs> Thank you very much, Kira. I want to hear the story. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm tired of this. I can't wait no more. What the hell is your story? Oh, my story? You know, the woman sitting next to you. Oh, oh hell no. I quit. Somebody oh, had to go for help. Oh, oh, wait a minute. Hold on. Who had to go now? Hello, who were you? Yeah, what's happening? What the heck? Who is he? This Kendrick. <laughs> what's up, Kendrick? Uh oh, the guy is starting to fill in. Ladies, watch yourself. <laughs> oh, we ain't scared. Hey, Ken, you, 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 hey, Ken we talking about we talking about all these women and how they be claiming you, dog. How you feel about that, man? Hey, Ken. Hey, Ken, Ken. See what I'm saying? That's exactly what we talking about, Ken. Now, all the rest of us came in here. We didn't get that. <laughs> okay, but all the, look, look, wait, all the rest of y'all got theme music and we didn't. So now what is that? Oh, that's what it is. Oh, that's wait. what it is. So, 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 Ken. Yeah. These women claiming you. What's up? Hey, ain't nothing wrong with it. No. <laughs> <laughs> that's what she said. <laughs> I mean, you ain't got a problem. You ain't got a problem with a woman claiming you. And you ain't claiming her. What is this? A woman I mean, you don't want to claim? Like is, you just like if it if it's a woman that you know what I'm saying I ain't trying to claim, then you know that that's kind of like bordering on the stalker shit. <laughs> Why well, everybody keep playing stalking? <laughs> <laughs> That's what I mean to be in a white jacket of fifty one fifty. Damn. Uh, wow. Oh, Wait a minute. Yeah. Joe, we got somebody else in here. Nah, man. That's it. Okay, now okay. tell your story, damn it. I'm going to tell my story. I'll be claiming Queen. Oh, it's story time. It's story time. Uh-oh. Queen, you got somebody else claiming you? Did she disappear? Wow. <laughs> Queen said, fuck it, I'm out. Why? I'm going to get my blocks. Y'all scaring my people okay. away. I want to claim so, Queen. I want to claim Queen. Wow. Wow. What the hell? Oh, Damn. Damn. Wait a minute. Okay. Everybody Wait, can't claim Queen. All of y'all can't claim Queen. All right. I see it's going to be a triple threat match now. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Who else claiming? Who, who else claiming my queen? Oh God! Oh Lord! Oh, he said my queen. Wait a minute! Wait a minute! Wait a minute! <laughs> if everybody's gonna be claiming queen, I might as well throw my name in there too. Fuck it, me and queen. Oh wow! <laughs> hey, I want to put my name in there too. Come on! Oh God! Hey, hey, hey! hey. Queen, queen, say, queen is wait. is the unit is is the unit mm-hmm. material. That's what that is. Oh, I, I'm letting you know. Wow. That, you ain't gonna be doing that queen to my BFF. Mm-hmm. Wow. Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, hey, she is a lovely lady, and she needs to be claimed oh. by a good guy. Oh, hey, I'm not a good guy. Hey, Paul, Paul, what did I tell you this morning, Paul? Okay, wait. Queen, I, mean, I want to hear Wait, 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 wait a minute. Hold on. God. Hold on. Is that queen that just came back? Queen. Yeah. yeah. Um, um, you, they all okay, let me, let me explain to you. Let me explain this to you. You got four people that's claiming you right now. What's up, Five girl? And Five and Clean Joe. What's going on? You got somebody going. <laughs> you know, everybody I said, wants I said, to claim you. I said you got four people in here claiming you right now. Five mm-hmm. including Joe. What's going on? <laughs> I don't know what that is about. Hola, mamacita. <laughs> now, first of all, that's a no-no because he knows who my BFF is. That's a no-no. First of all, I don't you know about no claiming. <laughs> no, I don't speak no no Spanish, okay? No, now she goes for his show speak Spanish. <laughs> first of all, hey, 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 Queen, I got your back. They're going to have to do their survey first. They're going to have to do their questionnaire, and then we're yeah. going to go through a... Ladies and then we gonna Ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen. Hey, hey, hold on. I do, I, I do any survey you need. What's up, Queen? What's that? Uh oh. Hey, hold up. Wait a minute. Ladies and gentlemen. Her. What? 
I got a lot of viewers that just got upset. Okay, 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 yeah. Calm we down. have a jobber, okay, have a jobber now. So, yeah. I want to say, I need all your inquiries about Queen Bee sent to Queen Bee. I'm the shit dot com. Oh. And we we gonna get back to you as soon as you know. Don't call us, we'll call you. Uh, Don't fuck call that. us, we'll uh, call fuck. you. Oh, fuck that. Wow. That's a background check? Fuck that. I'm out. That's <laughs> <laughs> a joke. That's a bad joke. Hold on. I'm background check. I mean, okay. am I applying for a job or I'm trying to get a woman? Well, I mean, what's up? Oh, no, no. Oh, you, oh. She's, so, she's so special that, yeah, you need a questionnaire. We're going to run your social security, your driver's license, your bank. We're going to make all oh, your money take care of you. No, I, I'm pump gone. You can't run my social security. Hey, I don't give out hey, my social security. Hey, pump your brakes. We ain't doing no SSI now. No. Y'all to do it. That doesn't say fuck your child. We ain't doing none of that now. Wow. Yeah, but wait, but Gator, what's your story? I, I want to hear this one. Okay. What, is somebody so claiming is, you? The, the most recent story I had. Was I met somebody online? We were conversating. Yeah, this always happens on me. Uh, we were conversating, and we were talking, and we have a good conversation. Everything is well, and so it was suggested we should Skype. You know, people do this nowadays to make sure they ain't catfish. You know what I'm saying? So I'm like, oh, okay, let's Skype. So we're skyping and we're talking. Everything and your is going comes great. Off? And, and the come off? Uh, she, she like blew me a kiss over the little Skype thing. Oh, and I was like, oh, oh, that's sweet. That's what's up. Mwah. And as soon as I said, nah, it went, what the fuck was that? <laughs> <laughs> wait, so you got her panties wet? So I'm like, so I'm like wait a minute. What the hell? What just happened? I'm just so. I'm on Skype. We're conversating. This goes on for a little minute. I'm definitely off. Forget it. The next day I go on Facebook, and um, I don't know. I, I just was scrolling through stuff, and I seen a status she posted. I'm like, okay, let me comment on the status. I went and commented on the status. She had a new picture. So I'm like, oh, this is a nice profile picture. Let me see it. Clicked on the profile picture. Went to the page, and um, I was her background. <laughs> <laughs> like, are you serious? Wait, wait. Really? Is her name, ba- is her name Bambi? Was her name no, Bambi? it wasn't Bambi. It wasn't oh. Bambi. This was be- way before but Bambi. You, I was like, what? The- know- wait, wait, but you already know what you did, right? Do you really know What's what that? you did? When you did Skyped her, You when you Skyped her, and you blew her a kiss, that was your check, yes. You now, made her wet. You made her wet. Now, let me, let, me explain this. let me explain this to the fellas. Fellas, this is my first time being on Skype. I knew nothing about Skype, fellas. Fellas, listen to me because I know we don't do this type of stuff. You take pictures on Skype. I don't want y'all to get caught in no uh, promiscuous... Uh, uh, unmanly type uh, poses. <laughs> uh, <laughs> let's get ready to rumble. I mean, I mean for real. I know. I mean, I was ignorant. I was ignorant to the fact. Yeah, I had clothes on. I don't be. Come on now. I ain't Joe. I mean, ooh. <laughs> Hey, so is it wrong that I was okay, climbing on Nick Mama? Joe ain't even saying that. He, he real quiet. If, if, if I wasn't eating this delicious chili dog, I would cuss you out right now. <laughs> I'm just saying. Yeah, don't mess with his chili dog. He'll bite your hand off. I'm just saying. That's money. Anyway. Yeah, I ain't but, uh, Yeah, so. Okay, wait, so wait. Okay, I, let, me get this, let me understand this real quick. You met this girl wherever you met her at. You mm-hmm. guys Skyped, mm-hmm. and then somehow she took your picture from Skype and made it the background of her Facebook? Yeah, I was a background. Like, I didn't know it until I went to the page. And you this gave was her like five next day. Well, you gave her five minutes of her time, and she took that as you guys being together. 
Yeah, we were together because she pretty much got on her page, and I when I when I seen my face on the background with the kiss lips, I'm like, what the fuck? What? So I'm going through her statuses, and she's saying, yeah, I met a new dude. We're together. Blah blah blah. His name and is such and such, such, such and I was like, what the fuck? Excuse me. Okay. I picked up my phone. I called it. I said, uh, what's going on with the Skype thing? Because me personally, this is, this is what I do. I like to get to know a person over oh, the phone, here we go. Oh, on the net, here we go. whatever. <laughs> phone before, you know, no Skype phone set. set. No, no <laughs> Skype set. No, I don't do that type of thing. Bullshit. Before Sorry. getting to know that person. Bullshit. Now, well, I'm getting to know you. I want to know the real you and all this fake bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> so in me doing so, I got her number, and oh, I was texting her before. You no, before I was, we was we was texting before. See, we were texting. Oh, now was your wrong. And then, that's where you went wrong. Yeah, wrong. Why did I go wrong? Never been Shut up, bro. <laughs> really? Wow. Yeah. Rapper getting on my nerves. <laughs> okay, so you sing it okay, to so you time time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Casanova. Rapper, I don't like you, dude. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what was you going to say, Monique? <laughs> so you, okay, so you were texting her before you Skyped her? Yeah, what, what's, what's the problem? What's wrong? My, my thing is she read into more than what it really was. What, that's the thing. you got to understand, when you are texting somebody, that's why I really don't like texting because, number one, you don't know what that person's emotion is unless you're talking to them on the phone. Number two, you mm-hmm. could say something and they can interpret it as a different thing or they could read under it where you're just trying to say, hey, uh, how you doing? Or, and it, that person can be like, hey, we together. You know, interpret it different. You know? But that's not but, his fault. That's, that's her. That's, that's her squirrely brain thinking that you're reading into that shit more than what it is. But, it, it, like I said, we weren't there, so we don't know what they were saying. It, it, like I said, yeah, it could be her fault. <laughs> she could be turbing it different. Gator could have gave off something. We don't know we weren't there, but, uh, but what the, what the key is. You're going to stop saying I'm the bad guy. <laughs> my thing is, well, all I want to know is you two together. That's all I want to know. I don't even care how the um, story came along. Let's just Are say. I just don't no, just no, like, no, just like the no. other person, just oh, like God. the other person you asked oh, me about a minute ago, they gone out my phone as well. So I haven't heard nor talked to them more. They not on my Facebook. Yeah, none of that is going on. So okay, mm. now you know what you don't, now that you don't know now, you created, right? You don't create it. Oh, something else. Talk to me. I must do that a lot then because. <laughs> okay, six. I'm an admin on a page Four on Facebook. Uh, will you shut up? <laughs> 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 I'm an admin on the page on Facebook. Now, on Facebook, on this page, we talk about all kind of stuff, and we do picture games and all that kind of stuff. People send their pictures and post them. Everybody comments on the pictures. Okay. So I commented on the picture, and I basically told the person how, you know, oh, you're a beautiful woman, oh, whatever, whatever. He hit me up in my inbox, and we were conversating. And then next thing I know, I'm getting a, a, a message from the head, well, not the head head person of the page, but the second head saying, what did you say to this person? They are mad. What they mad for? What the hell? <laughs> now, this is another person that it took something way out of context <laughs> because mm. she got a dude, and because somebody gave her a compliment, she was offended. <laughs> 
No, she wasn't That's offended. Her. No, 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 wait, wait, wait. What? She wasn't offended. Her boyfriend was offended, and he said something, so she played off like she was offended. Huh. So let's just okay. be real. Okay. Yeah. I got you. I was wondering that, but I didn't want to pinpoint it. So give me one woman who don't like a compliment. That's what I'm saying. So if you say she's beautiful... <laughs> And, you know, give me one woman who don't like compliments. See, that's, that's what I didn't get because her whole response was, oh, thank you. I appreciate that. And, whoa, there was no way. With that. I mean, she ain't come off to me like she was upset. So when when it came to back to me, I was like, what the fuck? What? But, but you know For what real? that means, right? But you know what that means? Her boyfriend was monitoring hmm. her, her Facebook or wherever you – did it. Hmm. Well, he comment he commented to her and so she has to play the role like she's really offended, but on the inside she's jumping for joy. Hmm. Hmm. Doubt it. <laughs> wait, I got wait, 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 wait. Wait, I gotta hear what Joe. I wanna know what Joe's gonna say. Joe, what what? Oh, nothing. Not, not, nothing. Yeah. nothing. No, please, please say what you got to say, though. Um, no, 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 I mean, I'm just saying, I'm like, I doubt that. I mean, there's always a different side of it. I doubt it, but go ahead. What's the different side? I, we want to know. Our yeah, I want to know, too. I'm They'd curious. love to hear your conversation. I, I would, I would, but I'm just, I, I would interfere right now, but I'm enjoying this chili dog brought to you by WCC, oh, or on Twitter at WCC Live. Follow us on Twitter at WCC Live. <laughs> <Go ahead. laughs> See, my question is, how long is this, this, this hot dog that you're eating? Oh, man. 30 is minutes. Is it too long? Is it too long? What the hell? Oh, my bad. Sorry. Oh, sorry. Okay. I'm sorry. No. Me too. <laughs> I'm sorry. Because I've seen you eat what? hot dogs, but I'm just like, I'm sorry. Hey, that's what she said. Hello. Ooh. Yeah, she did say that. Ooh. So I sure just did. Ooh. And Monique. Ooh. 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 It's okay. Mm-hmm. You don't want a chili dog, buddy. You don't want a chili dog. Hey, I got five of them right now for five for five bucks. Oh, that's what it is. You got five oh. of them. Okay. That's yeah, what it is. That was the question. That was the whole question. I was giving you for five for five. That is what's up. High five, Paul. High five. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if you can't tell, Paul and Joe are BFFs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, some people are jealous of our bromance, and I say, wait. Wait, wait, did you say y'all had a bromance? Wow. Oh, <laughs> whatever. I mean, you heard y'all get back to the topic. No, I mean, <laughs> people know what we're talking about. Wink, wink. No. Hey, what, why are you winking? Why you no, not at him. You know, I get a few women that, you know, say something about this. This is another show. show. Oh, the show is Monique. Monique. What? what? Monitor the visit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. I'm going to be in Vegas that week. I already made my reservation. I'm at my hotel. Oh, no, 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 no. No, no you're I'm not, woman. Be We're going to be hanging out with you, woman. <laughs> No, nah, I'm going to Vegas that week. <laughs> nah, mm, no way. Mm. So, we get these unclaimed tickets. People claiming you. If they continue to do so after you have a conversation with them or whatever it is that you need to do to stop this from going on. I have a um, serious question. You can't stop it. No, nah, you can't have my chili dog. <laughs> oh yeah, he'll yeah he'll bite your hand off and never you let you live it down. I'm a living witness. No no no. Wow. Okay. So you know how we was talking about the people who be claiming you, but you don't know they be claiming. Yeah. Right? That's what we're talking about. Yeah. Right, 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 right. I'm saying. So is it okay to fuck the people who claim you, even though you don't want to claim them? <laughs> okay, wait. I know, I know the perfect person to answer that question. Right? 
Oh. Yeah. <laughs> no, rapper give you a good answer to that. Rapper. His question is his question is, so the person is claiming you. You ain't claiming them. Is it okay for you to fuck them? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna need him to go to bed I, right now. I hear I hear a story coming. Rapper, right, come on. Um, well, if, see, if if you're stupid enough to go along with something you know is not going to go right for you, why not let you be in the situation you want to be in? <laughs> <laughs> but also you got to look at it. Wait, but also you got to look at it. Some women and some men will do anything just to be in that person's life, no matter if they're claimed or not. And that means have well, sex. And it means, hey, I got five, five, ten minutes or 15 minutes or however long it is of that person. Muted. Isn't it isn't it even true? If this person is already claiming you and you have sex with them, um, would they fall deeper in claim with you? Exactly. Well, that's, 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 <laughs> the was, that's the point I was that's the that's the point I was trying to make earlier when the doorbell rang again. You know, it's, yeah. it's the same you know <laughs> the 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 attention you don't give that same person that wants your attention is part of the game. Because the attention you don't give them is what makes them come to you stronger. Because you always neglect the ones that want to be in your life instead of the ones that don't want to be there. Mm. So neglecting that person is something that's going to make them fight harder to do what, to do whatever they have to to be in that situation. So if you play in the game, and basically you go from a physical aspect to a psychological aspect when you do that. Yeah, and that's where you wow. can get whatever you want out of that person. Exactly. That means Cam. Puss ass him out if you want. Yep. And money and all that and oh. cars and... So over on this area, what y'all saying I is that it's okay to use people? It's no. not okay. Well, well, I'm telling you, well, 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 it's never it's really okay, okay to use people. anybody. No, 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 no. Wait, we well, can well, well, all the same together. I did not say I did not say it was okay to use anybody because, like I said, if you are dumb enough to realize what I am telling you truthfully and honestly and you still don't care, why not let mm-hmm. you be in that situation because it is what you are choosing for yourself. Mm-hmm. There you go. Bingo, Yahtzee, Kino. Oh, sorry. Damn, she just went on, won the lottery and stuff. Um. <laughs> <laughs> I'm saying. I'm two minutes and 45 seconds long. What the fuck? Hey, the lot of us to like three hundred mil right now. Um uh-huh. my bad, I'm gonna need you somebody I'm gonna need you to pass that lot. Oh no, you are the first one, everyone. Somebody pass get a claim. Ooh. <laughs> 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 Is there a way yeah. other than you seeing it? To know that you're being claimed by someone. Yes. Oh, oh wow. you see, they got all your pictures. <laughs> <laughs> and I ain't even know it. <laughs> and they got pictures that you don't even know hey, you took. You don't know put that. red out there like that. <laughs> My bad. You know earlier. When, when you we got somebody, when you got somebody calling your job, somebody uh. Your wife outside for you. <laughs> and then I'm going to tell him, I'm going to need you to call 911 on that. When the hell I get married? When the hell I get married? I wasn't even yeah. at the wedding. I don't even have the ring. Where, where was I? Hold on, I'm going to do that shit too. Be like, it's like you know, I'm a dispatcher at my job, so the first thing I hear is, uh, come in, uh, government name that I will not give out. And I'll be like, hey, go. Hey, go <laughs> okay, well, I, I have a question. I have a... Wait, okay, he didn't finish it. Wait, he didn't... <laughs> Muted. He did My bad. I'm Muted. Then I'll shut up. And Ralph ain't going to be disrespectful and snap out. No, I ain't going to snap out. I'm sorry, Ralph. When I'm no, wrong... You go, ahead, go ahead and ask your question, baby. Go no, when I'm wrong, I'm wrong. I, I'm, I warm no. it up to mine. I, my, my apologies. My, my bad. Oh, yeah. I, I, wow. I understand you're a job prize, but go ahead. I'm just... I'm traumatized. Yeah, you you got yeah, you 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 whoo, you 
Yeah. No, I no, I said I, I she ajalapized. No, I'm just saying. <laughs> 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 oh, okay, what's the question? Okay, you, we are talking about everybody. You know, if you don't know, you being claimed or anything. Let's find out. You let's say you find out you being claimed. Could that claim turn into a, a real relationship? Yes. Yes, no. it can. Sometimes, it, sometimes yes, it can. It can. Yeah. Yes, sometimes it can. Don't answer that real quick. Joe, why did you answer that so fast? Depend, depend <laughs> on, no, for real. <laughs> I got a real story. Depending on the type of person that is and you know how you are when looking for a significant other, that person can be. However, I do not suggest that because more than likely if they're a stalker trying to get you, they're going to be all up in your shit in your life. Exactly. I'm sorry. Right. I, yep. Yep. Like okay, wait. Possible. Wait. Like Hold on. Be, be Hold on. No disrespect. So what is your what is your story? Because I want oh. to hear this. All right, all right, all right. No, no, this is really interesting, and Monique heard this already, and today I got the final results. Ladies oh. and gentlemen, ladies oh, and gentlemen, no. it you is. Did the test? No, not yet. Hold on. Oh. <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, check it out. It is story time. All right, so check this out. <clears throat> this past weekend, a homie of mine, no names. Shout out to Tony out there. Uh, no names, but uh, yeah. A week ago, well, yeah, like a week, last Saturday, actually, uh, last weekend, Saturday, obviously, uh, you know, me and my boys, you know, we decided to go out. We did a, a few little bar hopping here and there. Get ready, Paul, for that. Um, we're, you know, doing a little bar hopping and stuff. We went back to my spot. My homie was telling me, hey, man, something about this chick that I don't like. He's like... Man, if, if I could only figure it out, I was drinking one Corona, I was drinking two Coronas. Shit, I was even drinking three Coronas. So I got my little buzz on. I told Tony, I mean, that mystery guy. <laughs> I said, hey, I'm like, there's something wrong about your chick. What do you mean? Yeah, there's something wrong with your chick. He's like... Do you know her? Is, did she smash the homie or something like that? Or what's up? Is she that familiar? I said, no. No, no, no. That's not what happened. We started talking. I said, hey, how much do you trust this girl? He's like, oh, I trust her a lot. I go, are you sure? He said, yeah, dude. I fucking trust her with all my heart. And I said, hmm. I go, let's see, um, do you have her passwords to her Facebook and Twitter and social media? He said, yeah, but I never really bothered looking. I said, oh, okay. So you're telling me that you trust this girl and this and that and blah, blah, blah. He said, yeah. I said, hmm. D do me a favor. Go up to my office because my 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 club is uh, two stories. My, the top the the top story is uh, you know my office. The bottom story is the whole my whole floor. He's I tell him go upstairs, use a computer, get on Facebook, log in. Don't tell her that you're gonna do it. Just go upstairs. Tell her you're gonna be you'll be back right back, and this and that. Okay. He goes upstairs, log on to Facebook, types in her. Her whole thing, or whatever, whatever. Bam. Within the first five minutes, he went up there with a the cheesy smell. Like, eh, I don't have to really worry about this. Joe's tripping. Joe's fucking buzz. He's just guessing. He's just assuming. Goes upstairs. Realizes, hey, you know what? Hmm. Something up here. Why is her inbox full of dudes? Not only is the, is the inbox full of dudes, you know, there's even cockpits. Damn. On Twitter, direct messages from dudes hitting her up, this and that. He comes back down with the biggest, like, saddest face ever, 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 ever. And he just, like, nodded at me like, yeah, you're right. He pulls his girlfriend aside and starts telling her, hey, you know what? You said I could trust you. You said I could do this and that. 
Next you know, it was like, hmm. She starts looking at me, like, gave me the fuck you face. Fuck you, asshole. And she's like looking at me, but she's not coming to me and telling me. That. No, if I'm about a good five feet away, she's cussing me out with lips, you know. Fuck you. Fuck you. Die, motherfucker. Die. I'm like, hmm. Okay. I guess she got the bad news. They walk away. Pulls her outside, starts talking to her outside, starts telling her, hey, you know what? I checked your Facebook, this and that happened, blah, blah, blah. You know, the homie told me to check your shit and look what happened. Hmm. Okay. Speed up the story. Basically, she fucked him over on, on the internet. About two days go by. That's happened on Saturday. Two days go by. And, uh,. Same guy comes in again. This time he has this his coat over his wrist. And I was like I'm like, dude, it's fucking hot. Why are you wearing a coat or why you got a coat on her, you know? Why is he walking in with a coat? Dude, I'm tripping on this shit. He comes in, he sits down, starts huffing and puffing. I noticed that his heart rate is going crazy. He's like, <sighs> ah, he's freaking out. What to do? What to do? Hmm. He looks at me. I need to talk to you. Quick. I'm like, what's up? Talk to me. You know, it's Joe here. What's up, man? Talk to me. Talk to me. What's going on? And he's like freaking out. And he fucking just moves his hand from fucking, you know, moves his fucking wrist from his coat. He has like handcuffs. They're handcuffs, like literally on his fucking wrist. He broke off of one, but he still has one on and he can't get it off. He didn't know who to go to, so he went to me because he trusts me the most. I'm like, what the fuck? I'm thinking, did this fool just run away from a cop? Nah, he didn't do that. He goes back inside. He goes into my kitchen and I'm following him. And I tell everybody, my, my whole kitchen staff, get the fuck out. Everybody get out. Everybody get out. I call my two security guards. One, his name's Richard, a.k.a. Zombie. And my other security guard, Jason. Zombie's about, this is probably like the size of Big Show. If you guys don't know who wrestling, he's a big dude. He's a big motherfucking dude. Jason, the other there, stands by the door. I do, dude, don't let nobody in. Everybody's wondering what the fuck is going on. Why did everybody get kicked out of the kitchen? So zombie comes in and he's like freaking out, like asking, what the fuck is going on? Why, why, why are we being summoned here? You know why? What's going on? And he turns around and looks at the homie's wrist. He starts laughing. Oh, what the fuck? What did you do? Hmm. What did you do? What didn't he do? Finally, as he's trying to break it off, the homie's telling the story. Man, you'll never guess what happened. What happened? He's like, no, I can't tell you guys. I can't. No, no, that's fucked up. And he's, you got, you got a zombie. You know, he's trying to break off the cuffs and stuff off of my homie's wrist and stuff. He's trying to break them off. Nah, man, fuck, I can't get this shit off. He's being serious. He's hitting him with the fucking hammer and everything. Nothing. Can't break him off. How'd you break off the other one? Well, I just fucking pulled and this and that. And it snapped off. And he starts laughing. <laughs> All right. So I'm like, dude, so what happened? Nah, man, I can't tell you. I can't tell you. And I'm like, well, I'm like, he smells like weed. So, obviously, you know, not that serious. He didn't get pulled over by a cop and he took off running. So I'm thinking, okay, that's not it. He smells like weed. He's chilled out. Doesn't seem like he's really, you know, running from anybody. So I'm like, what the fuck? I don't think nobody fucked him up. He's a cool dude. He, he's not a drama, you know, likes to do drama and shit like that. He's not into bullshit like that. He's like, he almost like wanted to cry. I'm like, dude, what the fuck happened? Like, he starts telling me, all right, I'll tell you. I was like, he was like, yeah, man. Um, guess who, uh, you know, took advantage of me? I'm like, Oh, I'm like, what the fuck? Took advantage of you? I go, what do you mean? And then he wanted to cry again. I was like, what the fuck? What's going on? 
dude. I'm like, tell me, just tell me, don't, don't, don't be shy. You know, just tell me. This fool literally almost broke down and told me straight up that the girl that he was talking to, not only did she just sneak into his room and fucked the shit out of him, she basically raped him. A chick, five foot four, walked into his room through the window, busted through the window, noticed that he was just chilling in bed. Must have been a little high because, like, I'm like, how didn't you not feel a woman grab you by your arms and handcuff you to the bed? She snuck into his room, literally raped his ass, like raped his ass. Handcuffed his ass and raped his ass and took advantage of him. And what was even more crazy is like, I'm like, not being a homo or anything, but I'm like, did you enjoy it? You know, was it too kinky sex or what's up? Why? He's like, nah, man. He's like, I told her to stop, but she kept going. I'm like, wait a minute. I'm like, you got a girl on top of you. You didn't bother to kick her off. You didn't bother to do anything. He's like, so that threw me off a little bit. I didn't know what the fuck to say or think about that. I didn't want to, want to be thinking about the homie getting smashed like that. I'm just saying. This chick raped the shit. Not only did she rape them, she she cut him open. She she literally almost slashed his fucking neck, slashed his near his balls. You know, he has all these cuts he's telling me about and shit. I mean, he's feeling, like, awful. Like, he's really feeling awful. So, like I said, it must have gone to a point where this chick literally almost put a knife to him. Um, two days go by. After telling me the whole story, two days go by. And uh, he's telling me he's now working things out with the chick. He forgave her for what he did. I was like, what the fuck? Wait a minute. You just found out she's a hoe. She just raped you not too long ago. And now you're forgiving her. I was like, whoa. That's crazy. So, fast forward today. I found out one of the most craziest shits ever. This fool is going to end up marrying her. I was like, what? That's one of the reasons, by the way, I'm also, I was late tonight. But, yeah, I found out. This, this fool is going to marry some chick who literally almost halfway killed his ass. So, yeah, I mean, I don't know what you guys think about all that. It's pretty crazy. Yeah. I'm yeah. going to hell. I'm going to hell. Wait, I'm going to yeah. hell because I was laughing. No, 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 there ain't no goddamn say goddamn because I don't have no sympathy. Yeah. I was laughing. Yeah. <laughs> when he told me that I was on the floor rolling. What the uh, fuck? I'm going to now, hell. Now, 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 to answer all you guys' questions, is it possible for shit like that to happen? Yes. Hell yeah. Yeah. So wait, wait, wait. So he the got fuck, man. Joe, look yeah. out your window. <laughs> oh, she could come yeah, in anytime. Oh, shit. Wow. How, how is she still breathing, though? I kill you. Yeah, that's... No, no if, ands, or buts about it. You got to mm. die, man. Like, your life is over. I must right. end you. The fuck, man? <laughs> She has this fool in tears. And this fool's like, um, like for all you wrestling fans out there, this fool's like the size of John Cena. Crying. Literally crying. What? Yeah, she violated him, him, dog. Wow. And, and, she violated that dude. And Ain't she, no way in blue hell. And she is she the, violated she, him. And she is the size of AJ. That's the crazy part. Yeah, what? but Man, I'm a uh, them, uh, them small dude. I'm a witness. Mm-hmm. I've been working clubs. Do you work clubs? Yes, sir. I've been working clubs for years, and I've seen a five 
for probably a hundred twenty pound soaking wet yank a dude that was four hundred pounds across the bar. I didn't see it. My own two eyes like, oh shit. <laughs> that don't shock me at all. Right. Yeah, that don't shock me at all. That's I mean, why that's why I mean all you guys were like asking all these little nitpick questions. Well if wow. you get a smasher and still be with her or not. No, no, no. She so, what, I told, what I told Monique was this. I go see they she claimed them, right? She claimed them weeks prior. He didn't know about it. He's like, Fuck it, I'll just be with her. I'll fake be with her. No, 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 you fucked up right there. Not only did she just fake that. she not only did he fake it, but dude, she demanded him to be in a relationship. Not only this wow. demanded I kid you not, I bet you anything this was all her having him fall for it. And with the kinky sex and shit like that? Yeah. I think she put all those Ladies. guys up to Facebook. I think she already had it all planned. I think she Ladies, had a plan. Let's go out. back to what I have said every single show. Yes. Women in charge. Fuck that shit. Yep. yep. Now, believe it or not, a lot of dudes ain't going to admit it. Y'all in charge. Hey. Joe, Joe, look out your window. Hey, and you don't know what happened to, behind closed doors, neither. Hey, not to say, Joe. Not to, put, not to put my boy out, out on blast, not to put my boy out on blast, Tishon Jones, you said it correctly, sir. If a girl got a good head game, you're a keeper. And that's what happened to this dude. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Women, women fall for it, but dudes do too. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I was, I'm not going to I'm going to hell. I know. I, I'm, I'm claiming it now because when he told me that story, I was on the floor laughing. No, because I mean, at first I was like, well, if he, if she raped him, why he ain't going to go to 911 or anything? And then he had to break it down. You know what? Honestly, you know? I could give you an honest reason for that. Because of your pride? No, that has nothing to do with that. You know what's going to happen when he go to 911? He go to the police. Of course, they got to take a, a, you know, whatever it's called, take his, what happened. What, a, a, rape kick? a, a rape kick? A rape kick? They got to do all that. But, well, I, I'll say, yeah, it do have something to do with pride. Because nine times out of ten, when you tell another dude something like that, Niggas is rolling like you said. You was laughing. Oh, what do you think shit. another guy would do when they hear that? But my thing is, is like I was like I asked y'all. Said he didn't kick. He didn't get this girl off of him, even though he was handcuffed and you know all that. <laughs> you I'm never like, know if he was if he was sedated. The you know what the the only positive side of this, and I told this Monique already. Here's the deal: they both put the bullshit aside and went for it. That's the key thing that a lot of people that a lot of people are doing nowadays. Dude, she crazy. Hey, um, I can't be friends with nobody. Wow, wow. I mean, How if can you're, if, you love somebody after that? I'm just saying. How can you love somebody knowing they took advantage of you? How you know they're not gonna take advantage because, of you again? Because because you know what the this girl said. I want him as my man, and he liked that. There's a lot of people that undercover. They like that. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. If, cause it ain't, you know, no, no, you know what? It ain't even undercover. It's a lot of dudes be like, yeah, I like it, you know, girl that acclaim me. It It is the it's same way. Why that shit ain't undercover? It is the same way when a guy says, show me you love me. And you just, well, I love you, babe. I tattoo your name on me. There, that should be enough, right? No. No, damn, they mm-hmm. kill you. I love you. Right. Damn, they said this shit. They, they took it Y'all to the next. There's not enough people watch Lifetime. They took it to the next level. Oh God! They took it to the next level. They took the to the next level where literally they, like you said, like some of you guys said, they literally almost killed each other. So they were dying over each other. That's dangerous. It was just people in Virginia, and I'm telling you, I live right down the street from it. When I was living down the street, and this car drove up to the shopping center, it had a young boy in there. He was like 22. His girlfriend was like 34. And her mother was in the car. 
the girl was telling the young man, look, I don't, we can't be together no more. I don't want to be with you. You're about a whole bunch of games. You haven't matured. The mom got out to go in the store, heard gunshots. He shot her daughter in the back of the head and shot himself because she right. said she didn't want to be with him no more. This stuff is serious. That's why yep. I watch how I talk oh, yeah. to people. I watch how I flirt with people. That's why I don't do you a lot with certain people on the Internet because they take your words, and even though you think you're not saying it like that, they take it like that, and I yep. can't do it. Exactly. It's a yeah. dude. It's a dude. Um, not too far from where I live at. Uh, he 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 lives in the country, but uh, his girl lives up here, and you know they had they had like kids together, or whatever. And he told her basically, if I find out that you with another nigga, I'm gonna kill you. And he did. He right. found out that somebody was fucking with his girl, and he came up here, killed her, the child, and him. Wow. I mean, that's the thing. You have to be very careful. It, it, like I said, claiming can turn into a fatal attraction. Those, that becomes obsessive. That, that somebody's obsessed with you, and that does lead to death. Just like, remember my brother? <coughs> mm. 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 Well, my, remember last week? Well, my brother's in jail right now. You, you want to know all the charges? Assault and oh, battery. Wow. Domestic violence. Uh, resisting arrest. Terrorist threats. Uh... What is wow. it? Uh, illegal, having a legal firearm, possession. My brother's going to be doing a whole bunch of time. And you yeah. know how he talked all that bull crap about, oh, ain't no, you know, well, he found out where his wife was. Found out one of my cousins was helping her, was not with her, was helping her. He went the fuck off. That's I don't know because I don't now, even know the story. If, now if you go, if you guys want to hear the rest, you guys got to stay for the after show. DJ Gator, take it back, y'all. I don't even know what to say. <laughs> it's time to end the show, fool. I'm so lost. Yo, anytime <laughs> you want to join us, <laughs> shut up, on me. Time's up to shoot you. All you got to do is call 760-569-7676. That's 760-569-7676. We do this every single Wednesday around 11 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Join our Facebook page at, oh, I said at, <laughs> Sex Battles. Or is our Facebook page with the only place, Sex Battles page on Facebook. Join the page. We have over 200 members now. We're always talking about something on the page. I'm sure Joe didn't post it something already. So <laughs> join us next week. We don't know what's going on and what's going to happen, but we will be here. Joe, take us out of here. Wake the fuck up. <laughs>